Hello and welcome to another episode of Grom Brindle Goes Shopping. Um, I'm Ashen Ninja, the avatar of coffee, here to get no views as always. Now, I went through the end turn, uh, since that is kind of boring and nobody really wants to see that right at the start of the video. Uh, absolutely nothing happened, which is good. Uh, we demolished the uh, clan barracks and the granary that were sitting here and we made our chapter objective we didn't quite get all the bonus objectives but I wasn't paying attention to them so that's that's to be expected righto now Karazakarak is looking good uh, Varenka Hills is still in the hand of Barakvar and we are ready to begin moving on from here I think now, uh, Grumbrindle has... Oh, he's got a runesmith, he's got himself. We're all long bearded up. So we're looking pretty good. We're probably going to get rid of that fucking gyrocopter soon. And we're probably going to look at getting another Watch lord soon. Nice little Thane wandering around with him. Let's, uh, let's send Thane further down this way. Ooh, that's... Uh, yeah, that, that, that's less than friendly. That's not going to be too fun. But all the same. We'll do what we can. I think we've got lightning to strike with. I am the white dwarf. Grommy Pommy. Yeah, we do. So that'll be fine. So this is what I've done to him. I haven't got any of that yet. I should have all of those quests. What do we need to do? Karaknorn. Fight Norska. Uh, recruit. Oh no. Recruit another one. Oh, well, that's alright. Let's see if we can do that. Start with recruit a runesmith. Get that out of the way. Uh, I guess that one will do. The and move a character to peak pass. That's not too difficult. Remember correctly, this should be peak. Ah, uh, so over here, no. I don't remember correctly, so I'll click a button. Alright, so we've got to go to Peak Pass for the cloak. And we've got to go to Karak Norn for the armour at the moment. Well, let's go to Karak Norn, we'll go, go back to uh, Peak Pass on the way back. So that's, that is going to be his job for now. To now, hopefully my mouse pointer is in the correct place now. Um, but if there's any issues with the capture or anything like that, please let me know. Because uh, I'm actually doing display capture now rather than game capture. That seems to work better. Alrighty, let's get some walls in. Or at least a big garrison. And I'm going to put these go that in there as well. So as this go, as the uh, timber goes up to level three, we drop their upkeep for our quarrelers. So that'll be definitely handy. Makes me think one of the few times we actually do want to go and invade the wood elves because uh, they've got plenty of timber over there, and I'd like to really uh, reduce my costs. So we've got all that. That's all going. Why are we still... Wait, you know why? Because we have absolutely no drinking fountains. A drinking fountain of booze would be great about now, but that's fine. Now, one thing we want to be able to get is these things. The liquid fortification. But I do need pottery and a lot more oath gold. So I can give these to as many of my um, characters as possible. And it increases their survivability by quite a lot. Alright, well that's the end of that turn. Nothing very exciting to start with unfortunately, but we'll press on. Press on as we do. So the goal for the moment is to head down and <coughs> probably take out uh, Iron Rock 
and it was try and take out the orcs as well but that that, that that's looking even less friendly now this is uh becoming awkward but that's okay uh, hopefully he's not planning on going anywhere anytime soon he is raiding his own territory so that's a bit daft but whatever maybe he's trying to get uh some rebellions for himself might have to try and do some ambushing or something like that near um, our cities. Oh, we've got a military alliance now. Oh, that's okay. Oh, but this gr these green skins getting a little bit too powerful, uh, especially with the war. That's just not going to be cool. And I don't want to get smashed. That would be embarrassing. More ammunition? Sweet. Oh no, I could have gone here. That would have given me growth. Not too worried about any of that. At the moment, I just need more powerful units. So, volley fire it is. Now, so next turn, he's probably going to come running up through there. I'd like to try and intercept him. I'd also like to try and assault him, so what we might do is we're going to shift Grumbrindle up this way. They go down to minus 13. And we'll put him in in camp. Oh, not in camp. In ambush, yes. That makes more sense. Uh, what we want to do here is we'll increase that. We'll finally get our refectory so that our doors can go drinking. Swap that other one in too. He's going to go off to Karak. Start his trek to Karak Norn now. You know who I am. Those are those. These items are very very nice. Physical resistance and ward save, melee defense. Oh, that one is less needed, I think. Yeah, that's not too exciting, really. Magic resistance is okay, but the, the AI doesn't really throw magic around too much, so we're pretty good on that. That one's too big a deal. The axe would be nice, especially with the minus five upkeep as well. Income from post-battle loot, that would be also nice. Yeah, but that's actually really annoying to get, having to go fight Norska for it. Oh well, it's fine, just fine. So with our trade agreements now that we're exporting wood as well, because we always like to have a have, my, have a bit of wood. Now we can't rely on Barakvar to stay alive. So because of that, I don't know if I can trust them to. Uh, should I just recruit a new lord anyway? Make myself a rune lord. Total on our keep is just to be 717. It's not very good. I don't, I don't have very good options for lords. There at the moment. We'll wait. We'll go for we'll go for another end turn. We'll see if that changes at all. Ah, coffee's delicious. I think for him, we want something like strong or something like that. Something, like, something that might add defense to him or... Oh dear, dearie me. Now, isn't this a dilly of a pickle? You know what, I think I'll go after Grimgore. So we take out Grimgore, that, that means his wire is gone. And then we can go chasing the other orc, orc war boss All after here, that. Honored dwarf king. Be a bit of a pain in the ass, but... 
Oh, the lady, yellow for teeth snatches. Oh, wait, uh, I don't really want to add another another group of uh, green skins to be fighting at the moment. Got enough. Got enough wars going on. Yeah. Hit Grimgore. I'll probably lose Squighorn. He goes for that. But if the walls can get into Pillars of Grungni soon enough, I'll probably be okay there. Oh, jeez. It's just all coming along today. Some little bastard raiding me over there. Alrighty. Let's see. I don't want available to upgrade. Don't really want to spend that money yet with that army coming around the corner. So they'll be coming around the corner when they come. Oh, that sounds out of range. Oh, he is out of range. He is too. You know what we'll do? We'll go for an ambush here. It might fail. You can try and assassinate him. Oh, see so that's that. Now it might not fail. That helps. <coughs> Still leave that. Plus five melee attack. Not very good, but I want a rune lord. Just because I like rune lords. Normal lords are kind of better. Disciplined, which isn't really useful either. That's kind of good, but it only affects him. And they don't really try and hit your lords, they hit your heroes more. Yeah. So bring him out. And we're gonna give him some crossbowmen to start with. So, a bit of a hit to my economy for that, but what you gonna do? Hopefully we'll trap ourselves a Grimgore in the end turn. Uh, we are going to... I'll leave... I'll likely increase his melee fightings. So the idea with him, make him an assassin that I can keep in an army. Rather than... Uh, uh, just an on on field guy. So, we'll see how that goes. Oh, encountering more factions. Goody, goody. Now, the big danger for that particular hero is he'll get halfway there and get assassinated, because I've had that happen plenty of times. It's not even unusual. Ah, oh, Grimgore, you big pussy. Grimgore is such a wuss. Was well, who's that up there? That actually looks like it might be Azag now. I'm pretty sure that was just a generic lord before, but if that's Azag, that's that's something. That'll give us I think he's got a uh I think his traits magic resistance or something like that. Nothing too exciting, but better than a poke in the eye with a sharp stick. Or even a stick covered in dog poo. So that would also suck. So we'll see how that goes. Maybe we can bash on him for a bit. He's got a relatively small army, so we'll be fine. Oh, ah, oh. yeah, get right up in my grill. Yeah, Azag the Slaughterer. And it looks like I've gotten a... Yes, I've gotten a grudge out of it. Too. Um, okay, Forward. we're going to have to go back into ambush stance. I just There's can't reach any of them. I'll do it. What? Really like to get an ambush in. Uh, let's assault units. And I just remembered that He's got a minus 50%, so that's Master not, was not a good idea. Uh, Iron will. Well, the garrison, he'll have enough 
to absolutely destroy him. Right, yes. Let's see if he'll fight. Let's hope that we can get rid of him. Nope, he won't fight. That's fine too. Now, of course, he might go for something else. So that's going to suck. So let's give him a couple of grudge throwers and we'll get him a couple of them as well. Really destroying my economy doing this, but hey oh. <coughs> I'll throw our drinking hole in to the next level. Uh, next time we've got walls, uh, pillars of Grugni, so that should be fine. He's a pretty small force. Crypt ghouls, direwolves. The crypt horror might be a bit of annoyance, but otherwise. Mm. We're not going to upgrade that settlement again. And we're leaving Karag Dron as a uh, bit of a uh, tempting little treat for the Yorks to come and attack. <coughs> Hopefully this time we can actually get something in there. Alright, we get to encounter all the Empire factions. They're looking lively. Ish. They've got a lot of gobos and um, vampires and shit hanging around, so that, that could be a bit of a problem for them. What are you going over there for? Come and fight. Come and fight. Come on. Do it. Fight. Oh, well, we'll have to have a look and see how far away uh, Bitch Tits is with his big axe. And uh, if he's far enough away, we'll just try and hunt down Azag a bit. Welcome, King. I'm with a high king really want to get into a fight with him. But at the same time, I don't really want to completely abandon my own um, territories. I'm still trying to build them up a bit. Oh, good. The uh, Hearns have done some damage to the gobos over there. So he's buggered off with his big axe. He's probably only a jump away, but that's okay. We'll only be a jump away as well. So we'll head off after Azag now. See if we can um, give him a right good bashing. After all, he is a bit of a square. Oh, he's raiding. He's raiding. I am the okay. white dwarf. So we'll head. Not lightly. Apparently it's not likely to go there, so we'll head there and we're playing a bit of ambush cat and mouse at the moment. <laughs> Recruitment cost. Ooh. Ooh, Teller Tales. They're quite handy. Okay, he's not gonna be getting any help from anyone if I go fight him now. Never. Can I help you? That doesn't really look in any danger right now itself. Oh, Jesus. All these people raiding me. No. Uh, weak against armor. Problem is, all they are are melee. I don't have anything to really counter that. Uh, Vein. Seem hard to hit. He'll have to pull out of my territory next turn, or hopefully I get to stomp him. Now, he's actually got walls now, so I don't think he'll be able to beat him. Only 14. So I should, have, should be a bigger garrison, though. Oh, well. <coughs> Let's continue on. I know the old, uh, playing the old ambush game is a bit boring, but I don't have enough movement. I, I swear he should have more movement than that. Oh well. It's fine. Just fine. 
thought one of his traits was actually to increase his movement. Hmm. 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 Don't remember. I'll have to have another look at his unit card. <coughs> Grom Brindle, that is. In case I didn't explain myself particularly well. Which is not unusual for me. I do want to have at least one battle for this video. Because otherwise, for hell. For hell. Welcome. Friends of the Dowie. And I'd like it now to be against Azag. Alright, we found Azul. They want non-aggression. They're dwarves. We'll go non-aggressive with them. We like Azul. My actual hopes for one of, one of the things, because I know uh, Creative Assembly are going to be coming out with Lord Packs and that sort of thing still for Warhammer 2. I'm hoping for... Um, uh, uh, essentially, Karak gets Zul to get a um, a lord, preferably a, a rune lord as a legendary lord. Or the, there's still a legendary lord for dwarves they could use um, that'd be a rune lord as well. Um, what's his face? Uh, no, I can't remember these things anymore. Too old. Crag the Grim. Crag the Grim. See, just have to prompt myself. That's all. Alright, so he has not gone anywhere. We'll assault him again. This time we're successful. Ooh. And we get another. Absolutely rubbish. We are losing money at the moment, but that's okay. I'm still going to fight this battle. Shouldn't be too difficult. A bunch of biggins. My god, my archers are nothing. Poor boys. Squig herds though, they're a bit of a bastard because they've got armor piercing. What is their armor piercing? Oh. That's alright, we just have to make sure we shoot them up a bit. Do we want to fight? Yeah, we'll fight the battle. Bugger it. Yeah, we'll probably lose more for fighting it than if we didn't fight it, but that's okay. See what happens anyway. do hope this capture looks okay. I'm not sure if it's going to. But hey. Not too many people will watch it, so nobody will know the difference, eh? Hey? Now. Orxies. Orxies, Orxies. Now what we'll do is we'll get our long beards along here. So we're gonna, gonna use this tree line. Some long beards there. We'll throw our quarrelers behind them. Because quarrelers love being there. They are just delighted by it. Alright, we need to. I always forget about that. We'll do it a slightly different way. Right, the garage throwers get to go there. Uh, our helicopter. Fireboys. Fireboys can go here. Hopefully we'll get something fun for them to play with. Pop him there. He does still don't have any skills or anything, so he's fairly useless still, but that's okay. Pop him there. <coughs> Garage throwers, what are you firing at? Let's get them firing at the poor boys for the moment. Oh, which might have been what you were firing at anyway. Stuff. Look at that. Here we go. Come on, knock them off their boars. Oh, they are anti infantry, so let's change that up. Let's, let's just go for some big ones instead. We've done a little bit of damage, that's okay. They're going to do their best to flank us, so... Actually, these boys are anti-large. Let's get them shooting at them. The gyrocopters can do something useful. So a 
discovered some hidden foes. It's all right. Crossbowmen will get to shooting. Lovely. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. They should. Yeah, probably won't last long under that. Let's change your target to over here. Uh, let's see what you boys are doing. Oh. Okay, you're not going to fire at all. That's no good. Come on. Let's just pull them back. Strike out for the High King. Stop, killers. Turn around and get to firing. Okay, we're seeing off at least one of that. Ball boys are gone. Oh, we want to get rid of those squeaks. Oh, we're going to get some friendly fire there, but that's okay. All right. You boys go after them. You keep keep burning them until they're gone. Right. We're going to change you guys. You guys can now fire at my uh, at my foes there. Yeah. yeah. Oh, they've been being brave. You guys well done, stick after them. No need to guard. Oh, they've gone berserk. Let's start shooting. Okay. Right, as you command. Oh, there's no one there left to flank, so we'll flank them instead. Gyrocopter can get into the rear there. We're winning over that side, we're winning there. Yep. This is a pretty good one. That's a true, really. Get some stuff in range would be good. They're all melting. Come on, bad mouse, don't get stuck. Fire, reload, fire. That should be enough to see them off. Yep, they're shattered now. Come on, burn, 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 boys. Yeah, got them. Nice, good work, Bernie boys. Yeah, yeah, they're going to flee off in that direction. Oralers can shoot there. You shoot there. That's what they mean to a combat with. Fair enough. Uh, Azag? Yeah. See if we can get rid of Azag. Yeah, shoot into Azag as well. Do as much work to get, to get rid of him as possible. Yeah, Gyrocopter. Ah, there we go. That's eggs dead. All these units are pretty freaked. <coughs> pretty much gone, everything. We probably would have taken more damage in the auto resolve. Probably. Well, that's okay. We did quite well. We could have easily beaten a bigger army. Only 97 dead. Our line held quite well. And our killing units got some kills. 53 for the gyrocopter. Good work. Probably did a lot of damage to those boar boys. Squeak herds did almost nothing, so that's good. <coughs> How can I help? Grudge removed. We got an enchanted shield out of that. That's good. And we got Azag's little trait. The dwarfs need me. So that's good too. Plenishment will get us pretty much back up to full next turn. So that'll be handy. Throw another point in assassinate for him. 
unassigned skill point with him. We'll give him the room remove both in steel. Oh, that's right. Hey, having him in the front lines is good because of that. Standing near all of those are uh, all those long beards, so that would have helped them out quite a bit, actually. Uh, that means we're only at minus six gold now, so that's that's handy. That's good, good, good. Uh, Grom Brindle, what are we gonna do for you? We don't want that. Don't really need. Powering him up himself, because we've got that already. Uh, we've got his missile resistance. Might just keep powering him up for now. Okay, I don't know why it suddenly just moved over to that, but whatever. If we've got anything more interesting to give him. No, we haven't got any hand weapons. He's now got the enchanted shield. He's got okay melee defense. Look at that melee attack. 74 melee attack. It's magical attacks already. Uh, he smashes stuff. What's his armor piercing rate? 315. Oh, he's a, he's a good dwarfy boy. Yeah. I mean, we don't really need... That's pretty pointless. Again, pointless. I like the banner of swiftness, though, especially on the, um, on the Iron Drakes. Rank 7. Ooh. Got a rank 7 on one of our Crawler units, so... Doing okay there. He won't be back for a while. Don't know where, uh... Bitch Tit has gone with his big axe, but that's okay. Let's see, he's a spellcaster. What's up to the fact that the, <coughs> the whole crumbly thing? Oh yeah, uh, probably could actually fight that in a minute. Mm -hmm. So difficult. I don't know what to do. If I outnumbered him, I'd probably feel a bit more confident in a win, but... Um, probably got Regiment to Renown. I, could, I, I think I've got a, a Slayer Regiment of Renown I can recruit. Hmm. If I do that, then throw them against the Crypt Lords or whatever, and they just tar pit them for a while and do some damage since they are large. Oh, if he hangs around in the uh, in the province, we might do that. Might do that. I don't have a lot of melee though. So. Ooh, good work, Barak Var. But once again, you didn't take Brigham Town. Barak Var does that so much. It's never really actually takes the towns. No idea why. And I say I know, I've no idea why for a, lo a lot, of, lot of things, but... I don't know, that just seems a bit silly to me. Not looking too friendly there for them at the moment. Which could be bad for me. Me. I'm the one that's important here. It's all about me. Me! Jeez. Oh, so he's wandered off down that way, so I'm not going to worry too much about that for now. Quarrelers just got better. Uh, he's doing his public order thing. Weapon damage for all armies. Plus 20 faction wide. Don't think I'm in range for that. Oh, what'll be good is that. Let's go and ambush. Can I get you across? No, not yet. I'm gonna move him over to the pillars of Grungnir. My anger burns bright. Still losing money. Still. It's not really what I want to be doing. I am sure to clan and hold. 
I'm now losing more money. Finish the grudge makers. There we go. Oh, well. Research plus 10. That's definitely worth giving to somebody. No, I don't need that. Minus 5 upkeep for artillery would be nice, though. Another thing in hard to hit for him. Make him nice and tanky. Oh, that looks like a fairly easy army to beat. A few biggins. A bit annoying. They're just orc boys, they're nothing. Alright, goblins, whatever. Goblin wolf riders, bleh, whatever. <laughs> wolf rider archers, bleh, that's nothing. Yeah, we ought to beat that. What do you want? Next turn, we'll bring him across to help out. Hopefully we can do an underway intercept or You're not right dead. something there. Really want to stop losing cash. It's quite the despairing thing. Master of Runecraft. So what we want to do here is should give him. Might as well give him that. We'll give him that too. Yeah, that's not really going to help him, but whatever. Yeah, one table as well, so that's fine. Layers will you know now. Anything I can give him. There we go. That's what we want. Need somebody with that. Got them. Just really gotta hope he doesn't get An killed. An accord bound by runic law. Mm. An accord bound by runic law. What? Can improve things there fairly easily. I'm gonna leave it for now. We'll move on. Let's hope we can we can get bitch tits to uh, do something stupid so that we can ambush him or intercept him or something. Hard to sound triumphant with a mouthful of coffee. Alright, so we've all got the uh, plus 20% for all armies or factions, so that is not cool. I've got artillery to hold them off. I am going to save it. I'm not going to try and cheese anything though. Well, sort of. Let's do this. For the scryers, or for whoever it is I'm fighting for. Alright, so we want to try and maximise the amount of damage our artillery does and our range do. So we're going to make ourselves a nice long line. Front. This grudge must be satisfied. Of course, the grudge must be satisfied. All you fucking dwarves think I'm different. Uh, we want him up front somewhere. The ancestor gods. You guys go there. Let's put the iron drakes here. Maybe a little bit forward. Uh, they'll go there for now. Upon them. We can hold the centre. Start the battle. So they should come for me because I've got the range. Yep. And I want him to maximise his shots. Maximise his shooting. The chariots suck. They're only got wolf riders. What has he got? Archers, oh, I see. No. Let's not bother with them then, because they'll still shoot him and they might do a bit of damage. So we'll head over here. Let's see if we can get some shots in. Take down. To 
Groomy because I think he's got a half decent amount. Yes, yes! Yeah, a little bit of damage to Grimgore. Don't waste your ammo on them. Let's, let's get... Start firing at them. He's taking a fair bit of damage from all that shit, actually, so let's get him out of all of that. <laughs> Much as I don't really like having a gyrocopter, I don't really want to lose him that easily. Uh, a bit of damage there. They're uh, getting close, so we'll shoot at them. Some more hidden foes, eh? Hey? Nothing could stop us. Get them. Bit of fire on them will help. Gyrocopter's back here. Go by Wolf Chariot, I ain't doing shit. Those Wolf Riders are gone, really. War machine ready! Right, now, now we definitely need to pull them out. Them Don't want them getting so caught up in melee. Who's he? Is he in melee with Grimgore? Yeah, good. You get into him as well. Oh, that's bad. That's very bad. Oh, I'm gonna lose my friggin' iron drakes, aren't I? Hey boys, Move something. Now. Let the vengeance begin. Oh, iron breakers. Oh boy, that's it. Let's get them out of the way. Oh, that, that was close. This war makes fire. Right, them. <coughs> Fire at them, you Understood. fire at them, you fire Take at them. Your targets well. Hey! War us! Runesmith! Runesmith, you go over there. You join them. They're nasty sculptors, that's, that's less fun. Let's get them. They have wronged us! We're just absorbing arrows, that's fine though. Oh, no. the there we go, mass break. That's good. Good, good, good. Understood, Lord. Let's get some of good, some of these off boys. The Probably took more damage again, as usual, than I should have. That happens when you're not very good. Uh, do a bit of damage to them. They're in pretty good condition, so we don't like that. That should sort out his war at least as well. <coughs> Those biggins should be disappearing. They're still going to be around for a bit. 
other than my debacle with the uh, Iron Drakes. That didn't go too bad. There we go. So that's a lot of them fine spells. Hopefully we can get it. Not just uh, just another volley going in. Alrighty, it's the end of that battle. Grimgore will be successfully sent back. With his tail between his legs. Only 120 losses. Not too bad. Probably about 15 of those losses were <laughs> my damn Iron Drakes. I've got to be better at using them or I've got to get rid of them. They're an expensive unit, so maybe I should just get rid of them and not worry so much about them then. That is that done. Wiped out. Lovely. And that's the end of that war as well, so. Righty oh. That's 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 good. So we fended off that successfully. And that means we've also got hide strike for him. So an extra twenty armor piercing ain't too bad. It means we've I've defeated both of the legendary lords off there. <coughs> now I think with what they've got left with the rune smith and his little train of shooty boys, we should be able to take Black Crag. Without too many issues now. Let's see how that goes. But that won't be this particular Iron episode. To clan and hold. Now, for now, let's, uh, what have we got? Thogger. Let's try and assassinate him. Favourite word there is success. Okay, help. Doing quite well. They're at minus nine at the moment, so let's uh, move back over there. At plus nine. He's got like 16. Oh, the garrisons are looking alright there. Let's move him this way. Still at plus six, so that's good. We're now making a little bit of money again. I'd like to be making more, but it doesn't matter. Much much. We've got like six grand keepers. Keep us going. There's no buildings to build at the moment. So it's good. You know who I am. Get him replenishing up, and uh, we're going to make a run at Black Crag. You're not right, Dad. As long as they don't end up with too big an armies down there, we'll be perfectly fine. Uh, we want to go find our hero over by Norn. Uther Grobby Nutter. <laughs> Cool now. Don't mind I'm moving. There we go. So he gets another 1500 gold and 10 more oath gold. Oh no! How ever am I going to manage to win two battles against the Greenskin tribes? Whew, that's Onward. Where am I going to find Greenskins to fight? Alright, so we bring him back. Oh no, we need to take him to Peak Pass, didn't we? So bring him back to there. That's Peak Pass, I think. <coughs> Runesmith's duty is never done. Yeah, so that is pick pass, that's good. I don't really want to fight I can't I can't fight Norsk at the moment. So that that's just gonna have to wait until we can uh, send him off on an expedition, which it just Jeff definitely can't do at the moment. Some of the dwarf uh, weapon uh, uh, what are they called? Missions are just ridiculous. Like, uh, Thorgrim, you've got to get him two gyrocopters, and at that point, you know, you don't really need him to have his legendary weapons. You know, and you've got to send him off to go and fight Norska. You're so far away from Norska. It's just ridiculous. 
Oh, the other one, that's easy. You just go, blop, blop, blop. Oh, yeah, turn 10. You can now get your legendary weapon. You just gotta fight this battle. You don't have the army for it, but that's your only problem. Jeez. Yeah, no one are gonna get their ass kicked. Not unusual. Now, now the big question is, will, will, Isabella Car von Karstein still be around to help us with our replenishment? Does she do replenishment? No, regeneration. Oh, yeah. She can get us some re nice, shiny regeneration. Not replenishment. Okay, he burnt that down. Okay, fair enough. Uh, oh, he's taken Arkendor. Oh, is he at war with the border princess? At Welcome, King. Dozy. Arm of the High King. Bastard. Survey. Military Alliance, you are now at war with the Vampire Count, so yes, we'll get Major Alliance, but I ain't giving you cash. Uh, no, not joining war. You are the weakest link. Piss off. Or goodbye. Or whatever it was from so long ago. Nub Zub. Is it some kind of Ewok song? Nub Zub. Rightio, the heirs of Morkin are still just being cocks, basically. Somebody should kill them. I am the White Dwarf. <coughs> oh, aggression. No, I can't take the hit of character on it. The right. Dwarfs need me. Fortunately. A couple of turns of pulling that out. Oh, be helpful. Go off and fight some orcs. Hmm, what do we want? I'm gonna give them. They barely use wind of magic. Let's reduce the cooldown so I can go through there. There is a cap on the on wrath and ruin now, but it doesn't really do a huge amount of damage. But it's about the only thing that orcs get. And I'm gonna keep him harassing. Because I'm a bastard. Oh, I've only got 25%. Oh, I'll just move him closer for now. So I can see what they're doing. Can I help you? You. What shall we do with you? Well, I'd still move you. No, we won't move you down. That, that's a good way to get him. We'll move him over here. So that he's a bit more in range. Who calls me? Couple of turns of replenishment. And they'll be good again. Got three turns, so I'd probably just do two turns worth of replenishment. Okay, you're ready for your upgrade as well, Mount Squighorn. Well, let's spend most of my treasury. Come from trade, come from all buildings, five percent. Got that there as well. Oh, I'll give him the money building. That'll actually, I think, be more helpful at the moment. Yep. That's expiring in 16 turns, but we'll be keeping that the same. Guarantee that for the moment. Especially as we get through here. More. So we get minus 5 upkeep for that. Yeah. Reducing the upkeep on things at the moment is pretty important. <coughs> Getting more money is equally important, so... Oh, oh. Let's see what we can do. Oh, confederation with the scabby eye. That surprises me, because the green skin faction is actually getting fairly weak there. But for some reason, they can still take over other factions. I assume it's some kind of cheat, but I suppose Scabby and I were also getting pretty weak, so... <coughs> There's always cheats going on here. Especially since we're playing on very hard. Jeez, Barrack Fire is on an expansion! Bloody hell, they're going to be stronger than me soon. 
Can't have that. Why oh, should they not already be stronger than me? Yeah, they've got five provinces. I think my army's better than theirs, but otherwise, what the hell? That's just, it's just no good. Can't have that. Uh, they've almost got. I've almost maxed them, so that ooh, fear when coming. Yeah, whatever. Very exciting. No. Go on to that stance. We're gonna leave him there for one more turn. That's gonna get us actually a fair bit more money by the look of it. So that's good. What do you want? Do I want to leave him there for one Ready. more turn? Maybe I don't. Apparently I'm a daft git. That's, that's not surprising to anyone. Uh, let's see. Uh, uh. Unless we can... Oh, didn't unlock the third tier of that. So that continues to go that way. We'll pop him into that army when um, the time comes. Could want to use him. Yeah, one more turn. They'll be at full strength again. We will be sieging, so it shouldn't really be too big a deal. Yeah. So, I think that's where this particular episode will be left. So, I'll be just running the end turn outside of the video, because there's no point just sitting around watching an end turn. Uh, next episode, we will be going for the Black Crag. Make it our bitch. Get it back. That's going to be quite the battle Draw at that off. siege. So that should be interesting. So until then, good luck. Subscribe, like. If you don't like it, then, well, click don't like it. It's fine. You're allowed to do that. But until next time, sayonara.